Syndicate is real. A rogue nation trained to do what we do. They're coming after us with everything they've got. You ready? Tom, can you believe that you filmed the first Mission Impossible film 20 years ago? Was it 94? 96. Cause... Came out in 96, yeah, I filmed it 20 years ago. <laughs> That's wild. It is wild. Where it's did it all go? <laughs> <laughs> I know, I know, it's kind of, it's, it's exciting. It really has been uh, quite a ride, very exciting to see how audiences, global audiences have embraced Ethan and, and the Mission franchise. When you figure out a start date for a Mission Impossible film, how far in advance does the routine change with the diet and the exercise? You know, it depends on the movies that I'm working on because it's really figuring out and working with the stunt team uh, and the director as we're going through and building the story and building the choreography. We've never met before, right? There is an underwater sequence in this mm -hmm. film. I understand there's footage that exists of you holding your breath for six minutes plus. Do you surprise yourself oftentimes with the stuff you're able to do? Yeah, you know what? I try to hire the best people to come in and train me and I learn. I'm very much a student when I approach it. And am I surprised? Yeah, but I push myself and I make sure that, you know, when you're working with these people, I really dedicate myself to, to doing it. And that's also the fun of it. It took me, Physically, and I think it was the accumulation of the fight sequences and everything else, but it took a toll on my body. Normally, I can work really long hours and I can take, you know, and there was times where I just was in a fog. If you haven't opened that hatch after two and a half minutes, we're both dead. No, no, no. Ethan, do you copy? Ethan, abort! Abort now! So my understanding is that people who are big fans of the MI franchise are going to notice in this new movie little homages to the older yes, films. Yes, very Easter egg. There's going to be little moments to just to the other directors. It's tipping our hat to them and to the to their stories. So. And would you reveal them like on the DVD no, later on? Never. And say, no, not even then. <laughs> okay. So no, the, the real mission cinephiles will they'll know it oh my god 